Ripple Effect, sponsored by Suez. Every day we use technology to tell us what's the fastest route to drive, where our friends are located, and what restaurants to visit. Simply put, we rely on data and connectivity to help us run our lives more efficiently. Now, industry is taking a cue from this model when it comes to monitoring water use. Think of it as digital water. The digital technology allows you to really start to drive into uh, levers that you haven't had control of before. The ability to optimize things in real time, uh, be able to get tighter efficiencies on water reuse, power and energy. We have sensors, controllers, pumps, software. I mean, those are sort of the major pieces. They're just basically mini computers, and they're all over the place here in every building. It enables us to do a lot of work in a lot of places with a minimal amount of staffing. I mean, I'm able to monitor it through a phone, through, a, through an iPad, through a laptop, regardless of where I am, as long as I have an internet connection. And between real-time data and the historian, I can know what's going on everywhere in like 30 minutes. So what's possible when you connect digital monitoring devices that collect real-time data from the field? For thousands of locations worldwide, the data is sent to the Service Reliability Center in Trevos, Pennsylvania. Here, technicians can peer into the future by analyzing the field data to help predict problems before they happen. And this is where you know, we monitor customer assets on a real-time basis across 4,000 customer sites. You name it, we're likely there. So the team here looks at connecting the assets in the field to our cloud-based solution. And this is how we monitor activities which may have a very significant impact on uh, our customers, their assets, their performance, outages, uh, maintenance schedules, and so on. What started out as sort of remote monitoring and diagnostics, uh, we looked at that as, you know, how do we take it to the next level? We're using the information, because that's what this is about, is information, that's what data is, to watch for patterns, to watch for any warning signs. The more data that we take in and the more improvement we have in our analytic capabilities, the faster we are generating um, solutions. Because of the ability to have warnings, impending bypasses, tracking data that shows that the process is going in a direction towards potential violation. You can cut it off before it happens. I mean, the, the technology has made us so much more efficient. Digital monitoring systems and predictive analytics software can help save industry and our planet billions of gallons of water every day. Think about how many water main breakages there are a year in the United States alone. Over 200,000, right? And, but right now, a lot of that is wait until it bursts and then figure out how to put a team on it to go out and fix it. But if you can foresee where potential problems are before they become problems, you can operate much more efficiently and save a lot of money. That saves the consumer a lot of money as well. It's exciting times. It's really a remarkable opportunity to combine these digital and information with the industrial applications. You can make technology create work for you or you can, you can make it work for you and that's what we're focusing on and we have been. It's, it's pretty amazing when you think about it.